I know I just made a video on limited run games, but I feel like I need to make another. Because this is how limited run games makes their money. And they almost got me this week. They almost did. I got the notification. I saw this game coming out. I was like, wow, I have to have it. I just might never be able to get this game again. And then I checked my email. And I realized that's not the case at all. I came crashing back to reality. These games aren't limited at all. This email I got was also from Limited Run Games, reminding me to check their Amazon store. That's right, not their web store, their Amazon store. Because you can go there after a pre-order has closed and still pre-order and buy releases that are also out. All from Amazon, and then you don't have to pay shipping. You just get Prime shipping. I was floored that they just go around for weeks and weeks saying, it's limited, it's limited, you gotta get it, get it now, get it now. Only to be like, oh, pre-order's closed, now go get it on Amazon. Really? Is that really what you wanna do to your customer base? They feed on FOMO, or the fear of missing out, and, and try to entice you to getting off their website when they're just gonna go put extra on Amazon or take conventions or whatever. It's not really a limited product at all. Their FOMO tactics make you feel like, well, if you don't get it, you're gonna regret it. I mean, look at the third party prices. And yeah, that applies to some of the old games where they actually told you how many they're printing, but they don't anymore. They print who knows how many. They're just like any old publisher. It's not public knowledge. So there's probably a ton out there, especially if you can go to Amazon and keep getting it after a pre-order window is closed. Rendering Ranger is the game that almost got me. I was scrolling through, saw Facebook, Wow, Rendering Ranger for the first time in English, Japanese exclusive SNES game. And somebody put in the comments, wow, a full inbox copy is like $2,000 from Japan. So I went on my phone and I checked eBay and then, yeah, they're expensive, but not quite that expensive for a complete copy. And then you can get a repro copy with an English dub for like 20 bucks. Isn't that kind of what Limited Run Games is doing? They're taking the original, it's gonna be better than probably what these $20 cartridges are, but it's still like an English dub that they've done, and then they're reselling it to you. I don't even own a Super Nintendo, and I almost fell for this. I almost fell for buying this game that I can't even play, all because there's this fear of, get it now, it's never been printed before, this is limited. Saying things are limited is a tactic that so many retailers and suppliers use to make you feel like you have to go to buy it, whether it's is actually limited to 50 copies or 50 million copies. You don't know because all they say is it's limited. That's all they have to say to entice fear in you that you have to buy it right now. Scott Pilgrim is a good game to pick on because they hyped the pre-order window for so long saying it was limited and if you go check third-party resellers like eBay, a lot of those copies are at or below the original MSRP or you can still go to Best Buy and get a copy. And at one point, Best Buy even had them as like a deal of the day and they were 15 bucks. That's well below what that asking price was originally on their website. I didn't need to tie up my money for a year waiting for my copy to show up when in actuality, there's still so many out there months and months later after I received my copy. And I actually could have paid less so this is how limited run games makes their money. It's FOMO, it's just fear of missing out. They instill fear in you to make you feel like you have to buy their game. Trust me, you're not actually missing out. You can find that game on an eShop deal for five bucks. How often are you actually gonna play that indie game? Is it just gonna sit sealed on your shelf? A lot of times these copies are ending up on eBay and you can find deals on them later. Quit doing the FOMO, quit buying from Limited Run Games website. If you really want it, go get Amazon so you get the free shipping. Just quit feeding the FOMO, quit, quit doing it. Just leave it alone. If you liked the video, hit that like button, leave a comment, say something weird like I have beef. So I know you made it this far and we will catch you next time.